we are going to have a look at Joule temperature. Joule temperature is a temperature point where the ferromagnetic materials lose their magnetic property and becomes paramagnetic. So now let's talk about what is ferromagnetic and paramagnetic properties. Now we can talk about uh, iron metal for example. Iron metal is a ferromagnetic metal uh, below the 770 degree and it becomes paramagnetic. I mean it's not attracted anymore by magnet after 770 degree when you heat it. So now if I explain that when our metal is ferromagnetic Magnetic spins are aligned in one direction, something like that. When you heat it, when it's above the jury temperature, for example, that's our symbol, and iron loses its magnetic property at 770 centigrade degree. This is our dew temperature for iron. When we pass that uh, temperature, it becomes the spins, magnetic spins, they they move randomly. So, because of that reason, it's not attracted by magnet anymore. So we can explain it like that, ferromagnetic uh, material becomes paramagnetic. Now, I'd like to give you some examples. For example, our material, and this is jury temperature. Iron. Cobalt, nickel. Now I wrote some examples uh, such as iron, cobalt, nickel, gadolinium, and magnetite, iron oxide. As you see, they have different jury uh, temperature. For example, this might that might be interesting, such as gadolinium. Its jury temperature is 19 degree. That means it's uh, ferromagnetic in winter and paramagnetic in summer. So these are the some elements or some chemical compounds. Now guys, uh, I would like to give you a, a simple demonstration example. For example, that's our nickel ring. We hang it like that. And that's our magnet. When you, for example, when you have this mechanism, First step will be like sorry. Nickel ring will go on the our magnet. In the second step, if you hit that nickel uh, metal above the 358 3, 3, uh, this is our jury point if you hit above that uh, degree it will be it will leave from the 
magnet. It will become like a. So our third step. It's uh, slowly. It go. It goes again. Goes on to magnet when it below the that degree. Feel like the sun. Two, three, and lastly, it will stick on our sheet. That's our demonstration about zero point. Uh, to sum up, zero uh, point is a point where ferromagnetic or other magnetic materials, they lose their magnetic property and they became paramagnetic. That's why they are not attracted by the magnet anymore. But if you cool it down, so again, it, uh, it will have its magnetic property. That's all for today guys. I hope you enjoyed my lesson. Uh, see you next time. Bye.